what's up, nerds? So they dropped this trailer for Andor. Uh, 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 this second trailer. Sorry, sorry. Um, and I was gonna say season two, but it's the second trailer. I meant to say the second trailer. Um, and I have to say, the first trailer, I liked the first trailer. Um, I liked Rogue One. I like Diego Luna. He's a fantastic actor. Uh, very adorable. Um, and I liked uh, 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 Rogue One. How it was like. I liked the setup and everything. And and I also liked how. You know, it fit continuity wise. A lot of the stuff that I don't like about like Star Wars nowadays is they're trying to they Disney creates this continuity and then they they break it. And I'm all like, but you you set up this continuity. Stop breaking your own thing. And if you do, you know, like, for instance, uh, in Obi-Wan, when the Inquisitor gets killed and everything um, and then they brought him back. I'm all like, well, there was no point to kill him, you know, because you're just bringing him back. It was just it was lame. So I'm all like, I hope they don't do this. Um, this is uh, Tony Gilroy. And I think that he is a better writer than that Joby. What's his face that wrote Obi-Wan. And I just also I have to say, besides the Mandalorian and the animated stuff, the animated stuff like the Bad Batch is pretty good. Um uh, it, the the first half is not the best, but uh, Obi Wan and uh, Boba Fett. I didn't like either one of those shows. I didn't like them. I thought that it was just it was just too. I don't know. Like like I, I liked the uh, the thought process behind it, but then some of the stuff like in oh uh, uh, Boba Fett with the with the colorful Vespas and then the the riding the Rancor and the Godzilla moment Rancor thing. Uh, it was I mean a uh, uh, King Kong rancor thing where he's climbing on buildings it was it was just too silly too silly but i think that andor is going to take a more mature approach and everything so i'm 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 excited to see that hold on i have a fan on i had to turn that off sorry um but i think i think that uh i think it'll be i think it'll be pretty good i i i will see we'll see it's going to be eight episodes um for eight episodes, I think it is for this uh, season, um, which will be interesting. Don't get mad if I got the episode wrong. I'm going to stop yapping now and dive into this. Here we go. Boom. Oh, see, I, I really do like seeing the Star Destroyers. They're, uh, I mean, uh, yeah, the Star Destroyers. They're very... um. Architecturalized are very cool. To steal from the Empire? You just walk in like you belong. They're so proud of themselves. I also like the same. So fat and satisfied. They can't imagine that someone like me. Yeah, you know us Every colonizers. We love it. We love your resources. The Empire is choking us so slowly. We're starting not to notice. What I'm asking is this. Wouldn't you rather give it all to something real? I need all the heroes I can get. For the greater good. Call it what you will. Let's call it war. Mm. There's fermenting out there, son. Pockets of fermenting. You're in my net. Are you a fish? Or are you a thief? Mm. You're slipping. <laughs> I'm not slipping. I've just been hiding for too long. Mm, very cool. I as love course I am. thinks I'm an irritation. There's a good chance they'll miss what I'm really doing. What are you really doing? She's setting up a rebellion. Ooh, I wonder why she's crying. This is what revolution looks like. I'm tired of losing. Ooh. Oh, hey. It's like Maz Kanata. Oh, three episodes. That's going to be a lot to cover. Um, okay, uh, this looks good. It looks good. I think it looks good. It's uh, it's a very, it's a little political. Um, I wonder. Okay, so there's a scene where like there's some people in white robes. 
running across this uh like bridge with glass windows and everything M- the my first thought seeing that was clones the little kid clones you know from um the bad batch they were moving them off of um um the water planet shoot i'm i'm drawing a blank with the neck people and they're all like um oh what uh uh uh, uh, uh. Oh, it starts with a K. I keep wanting to say Kashyyyk, but that's the Wookiees. Ah, okay. Anyways, um, this looks good. I like, okay. What's her face from Harry Potter? Uh, she's crying. I wonder what she's crying for. Um, they've got this little red robot. It's so funny. They got this little red robot right after that. And they, they've got this to where you could sell it and it looks ridiculous. I'm like, why would anybody pay money for that? It's ugly. (laughs) So, um, um, and I like that. She's all like, if I, if I keep like, what does she say? If I keep pestering them they won't see what i'm re- or if they think i'm an annoyance they won't see what i'm really doing and he's like what are you really doing and that's um mon mothma and she's you know the leader of the rebellion which is which is cool um and then i did like that what's his face scars guard he shoots that gun and he's like he's like fighting and stuff that's pretty cool um i do this looks really good this looks good i like he's he's obviously somebody higher up in when it comes to Coruscant and he's like mingling with uh that looks like Mon Mothma um so I'm curious as to how he who he is and how he plays his role and it'll just be interesting to see uh see um this whole thing go down the rebellion gets started and get going and everything and I like how it talks about pockets and then if you remember in Rogue One they they had that little meeting of people around that that table and they were all like and then um the Mon Calamari guy, he sent his fleet and everything. And I was like, that's interesting, you know, that they've got little sections of the rebellion and everything. It's, it's very, and I did like the line where she's like, she's like, I've got you in my net. Are you a, are you a fish or are you a thief? And I was like, Ooh, that's good. That's good. So I, it'll be, like I said, uh, I think Tony Gilroy is a much better writer uh, than that Joby guy for Obi-Wan. So I think that this uh, looks a lot more promising as far as Star Wars live action shows go. Um, yeah. All right, you guys, those are my thoughts on this. I think it looks good. Tell me, what do you guys think about it? Uh, do you think it looks good? Do you think it looks bad? Who do you think is going to be uh, in it uh, that you want to see and all that good stuff? Tell me what you guys think. Go ahead and leave all your comments in that section down below. If you like this video, go ahead and that like button. You know, I won't mind. If you're my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And we'll see you guys on my next trailer reaction. You guys have a good day. May the force be with you. Bye.